Welcome! I guess you accidentally clicked on my newest video and now you're not going anywhere because I just know in the next few seconds I will convince you that this full version of high intensity interval aqua workout is exactly what you've been searching for. Just watching this workout will cost you maybe 8 calories, but if you follow me along, you can burn up to 800. You are about to experience the best aqua workout I've ever posted on this channel. What are you waiting for? Splash in and let's do something great this summer. Ooh, by the way, in case you only have 30 minutes and still want to do this workout, check the express versions that I created linked at the end of this video. Yeah, you're welcome. With that being said, you no longer have any excuses. I love water. I love the sound of it. And I love being near the water. Or on the water. But most of all, I enjoy being in the water and working out. And convincing you to work out with me. If you enjoy this video, make sure you like it, share it, and subscribe to my channel. Find me on Facebook. Ready for another great workout? I hope to support you are. the existence of it. this channel, consider becoming a Patreon. If you want to learn more, go to the website you see on the screen or linked in the description. So go ahead, dust off your set of aqua dumbbells and buy yourself webbed aqua gloves. Link to those I'm using in the description. Oh, and don't forget to wear some good water shoes or you will know why I regret it not wearing mine while I was making this video. Time you guys gonna notice blinking hard? It means you are 5 seconds away from finishing this particular exercise. Round 1. 30 seconds aqua sprint and 30 seconds jumps. You'll be jumping forward and back. We'll repeat each exercise 4 times. So here we go. Aqua sprint, extremely fast legs and super fast arms. Now, to make this segment even more challenging, I encourage you to wear aqua gloves. These are special gloves that you can find in the store I represent and I'm not wearing them today because guess what? I forgot and I regret it. I also forgot my shoes and I regret it even more. <laughs> so let's keep that tempo going let's breathe through it the faster you move the faster your breathing should be with your arms you basically draw a circle underneath the water you shouldn't see water being splashed Woohoo! blinking hard you know what that means we are wrapping this one up and moving smoothly to the next exercise jump forward and backwards right imagine you are jumping over something Please notice I am not jumping up and down. Everything happens below the surface. I'm tucking my knees up and then I'm pushing my feet forward. Now this water level is not ideal for jumps. This is where I want to make the video. But if you guys have option to move to a de little deeper segment of the pool, that's where you would be with your aqua jumps. It's a little less intensive. But it's not recovered yet. We keep going. All four repetitions. You should feel your heart beats like crazy. Keep smiling because this is a happy exercise. Are you smiling, guys? I'm smiling. Keep going. Blinking heart. You know this means I love you guys. It also means that we are switching exercise. It's aqua sprint again. Let's go. The same R moves. Turn around, maybe. Make it fun. Make it interesting. Don't bounce up and down. 
because guess what? If you bounce up and down, you're burning less calories. What a waste! Why wouldn't we hit the 800 mark? Link your fingertips if you are not wearing gloves. If you are wearing gloves, you do the opposite. You're going to spread those fingertips. Blinking heart. Love you. And you got five seconds left. Wrap it up. Wrap it up. Jumps. Forward. Backwards. Love it. So letting you know that we have remaining few seconds left was one of my subscribers suggestion. Thank you so much, Lisa. I appreciate and I absolutely agree this may be very, very helpful. It's not for you to think about finishing exercise. It's for you to actually start doing your best because you know it's almost ending, right? Keep going, use your core strength to tuck those knees up and down. Yes, it's your six pack forming there. <laughs> six pack in process, right? Blinking heart, wrap it up, couple more. And you're already thinking about switching back to aqua sprint, so let's do it. Again, if you want to make it more interesting, turn around. You can move just a little bit forward and back, but do not compromise that speed. This is all about tempo. This is one of the most intensive workouts ever posted on this channel. So make sure that's exactly how it feels eventually. Blinking hard already. Five more seconds to go and you are switching back jump it over front and back no bouncing yes yeah, still using those arms even without gloves you guys gonna feel how challenging this will be right keep going jumping forward jumping backwards I just know you guys picked this workout because you are ambitious. Fall in love with taking care of your body. How amazing this thing is. Yeah, doing something awesome for yourself every single day, even if it means just an hour, like this workout, it's good for you. I'm sure you are feeling it. These jumps are great. I can't believe I forgot my gloves. They are always, I actually have two sets just in case I forget. And guess what? I forgot all of those. <laughs> all right, well, let's get ready for aqua sprint again. Link those fingertips if you forgot gloves like I did, or spread those tiny fins between fingertips if you got your gloves. Here we go, quite fast. Did I say quite fast? I mean super fast. Here we go. Insanely fast legs. Go, 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 go. Remember, the less you bounce, the better you're doing, the more calories you're burning. It may feel like you're doing more with all the bounce up and down. Trust me, you're not. Keep it all low impact. Deal with the resistance and everything else the water offers. That's called Aqua Challenge. And you see what's happening? This little heart on the screen is just a reminder. We are wrapping up this segment and switching exercise for our jumps front and back. Every single time your feet move off the bottom, you wanna exhale. You feel those lower abs getting contracted? Well, of course you do. Let's shape that six pack. Woohoo! Say I want it if you are working on your six pack. <laughs> I am. I know it's there. You can't see it, but it's there, hidden. 
And Blinking Heart is just another reminder that we are wrapping up this exercise and also this round. It's time to use aqua dumbbells. Maybe also a great moment for a quick water break. Round two, we're gonna be moving side to side with eight punches. And then we're gonna have cross country skiing with some arm variations, which I will show you. All those two exercises, again, we're gonna repeat them four times each. And get into the position and moving sideways eight times for now. Punch, 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 punch. Keep your feet open. Notice it's wide jogging. We are curling those knees up. Now I want you to focus on one side, right? That's where you're heading. That's the punch that's really going on. If you want to move your other arm along, that's fine. But your attention goes to one side. I need you to imagine that target and punch it so bad. Can we do it? Don't worry how far you actually are going. Just feel that your body is moving. It's burning calories. Keep going. Six pack in progress. Yes? <laughs> It's happening, guys. It's happening, believe me or not. Now I'm heading to the right. Come on, follow me. All right, and now I'm heading to the left. Where are you going? Punch, 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 punch. If you work out with somebody, you guys can head either in the opposite direction or together. Use your core strength to push this dumbbell away, to pull it back quickly, to move those knees like this. Yes, you see the heart? All right, what it means is you switch to the next exercise. Look, it's cross-country skiing. You're gonna open your arms, then close, then you pull, drag. You drag dumbbells in and out. So you open, close, pull dumbbells towards yourself and then push them forward, just like that. We are not tucking those knees because we're going to switch to the previous exercise and you know this one is all about curling those knees. So here, keep your feet close to the bottom of the pool. And again, I know I'm going to repeat myself, I hope you got your aqua shoes because my heels are going to be sore, I know that. Ooh. I have a good memory, but it's really short. <laughs> For today, I forgot gloves and shoes. Not cool at all. So keep going. Drag them. Notice dumbbells are in a horizontal position. We're only going to do a few amazing reps. And then without stopping, we're just going to switch to the next exercise. Side to side punches. How about if we just do four now? Is that great? Yay. Four, three, two, one, switch. Four, three, two, one, switch. You can move in a zigzag motion forward and backwards along with side to side moves if you want. Yeah, you're gonna be all over the pool, why not? You own this place, this is yours for the time being. <laughs> you guys have no idea what I have to do to make this video and be alone. For me, it's super, super early wake up. <laughs> All right, cross country skiing, but it's worth it. It's worth it. I always feel I work out together with a big group. Guys, over 15,000 strong. Would you imagine? No one even have a pool that could fit all of us <laughs> but that would be pretty cool aqua workout maybe one day in an ocean all of us deep aqua aerobics wow we would break some records that would be fun i have to think about it yeah give me a couple months to think about it and maybe organize it <laughs> but right now you are where you are i am here and we are cross-country skiing, arms out and in, pull back, push forward. Go, go, go. Feeling the arm strength. Oh boy. We're gonna have awesome arms. It's gonna match our six pack. Awesome. Eight punches again. Why not? Let's go. Keep going, keep going. 
push, 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 push without stopping. You're just gonna switch sides. Is that good if I, if I leave you alone for a little bit without me talking so you can maybe sing along and enjoy the music? You guys know what to do. Come on, just keep the heart rate up, sing along. Blinking hard, you're almost done. For now, you just switch to the next exercise, cross country, push forward, open, close, pull back. You got this. You're still doing amazing, right? Or can you do a tiny bit better? Come on, squeeze that out. Give it to me. You picked a tough workout for today. Now you have to do it. One good choice. I got plenty of rounds ahead. Blinking hard. Blink, blink, blink. Finish up. Yes looking cool let's move again to the right to the left for each way again come on are you getting a little bit slower i see you guys come on a little bit faster it's high intensity aqua i just came up with the name now you have to make that happen keep pushing keep pushing use those apps Yeah, it's really hard to maintain the same speed closer to an end of each round. But I'm here to remind you why it's so important. That's how your body is getting stronger. Your body remembers those last minutes. It will make your body stronger, right? Your body is getting stronger because it will remember for how long and how fast you were doing it today. So next time it's gonna be easier then it's gonna be easier and then you know what's gonna happen I'll just have to have a sleepless night and come up with something even more challenging for you oh boy challenge is on keep pushing keep pushing keep pushing blinking hard is on a screen you know what that means you are slowing down cross-country skiing is happening again Keep those dumbbells below the surface, not too deep, please. Just below the surface, horizontal position. Do it right. If you guys complete this full version, oh, you need something easier tomorrow, okay? And don't feel bad about it. But I need you to remember that there are two other versions of this workout, 30 minutes each. Basically, these are this is the same workout, just cut in half. And I need you to remember about those. If maybe you are in a hurry, maybe, I don't know, whatever, you just don't feel like doing full workout, then you know there are shorter versions of the same crazy fast aqua intervals. 
still cross country skiing, still working those muscles, building up. Getting there, one push at a time. And still smiling. Oh boy. You guys are doing good. Blinking heart is telling you what? That I love you. Yeah, let's shake those dumbbells a little bit because they are getting dry. And we are moving on to round three. Look what arm's gonna do. We're gonna go circles out four times and then circles in four with knee repeaters, 30 seconds each four times. And then I'll tell you what's next. Can we go super fast again? Absolutely, let's go. As always with those knee repeaters, make sure one foot is grounded on the bottom. No bouncing up and down. Blinking hard on the screen. What's happening? You are moving to power waves. Now you're gonna splash this water, the water side to side. Well, you can splash if you're alone in a pool, but if you have a company, maybe go with more like the wave movement. I'm doing this really fast, but if you wear gloves, you're definitely gonna go a little bit slower. You're working twice as hard. That's fine. Blinking hearts, you have five seconds. That was quick. Switch leg and continue with insanely fast knee repeaters. Keep going, keep going. Don't forget to switch those arms, right? You go out four times, then in four times. If you wanna do your freestyle, you can go three out, three in, but I don't know. All right, it's still fine. <laughs> I need you to move your hands as fast that you really don't know in which direction they are actually moving. Are you feeling those abdominals? I do. They are in a water on fire. Good stuff. And no crunches. Yeah, crunches are the worst. Okay, blinking heart. Yeah, 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 five seconds left. Power wave, side to side. Make sure you guys can see on the water how much energy you are creating now with this movement. Come on, you are using your abs, especially those obliques. Everything that's surrounding your spine is now getting stronger. Is that important for you? Super important to me, hello. I want good posture and healthy spine. I know you do as well. Blinking heart is on the screen again. You are finishing up this exercise and you are mentally ready for knee repeaters. Let's do it. Pull this knee forward, forward and up. Remember, you are not shifting your body weight to that toe that moves up and down. Oh boy, we are doing fine. Keep going, don't forget to reverse those arm moves and smile. Oh my goodness, so many things we have to remember. Yep, power waves. I'll remind you this one. Come on, still doing your best. That's our third repetition. Beating heart. Final seconds and switch leg. Knee repeaters are happening again. Love it. Low impact, challenging, intensive. 
total body exercise. What else we need? I know, one thing. Ice creams. Oof. No, 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 no. We've worked so hard. No, 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 not ice creams. Let's get something healthy. <laughs> Do you guys like ice creams? I'm obsessed with ice creams. But you know what? There are actually good and healthy ice creams too. Besides, it's summer. Summer means ice creams and aqua and water and sunshine and amazing energy and power waves going on. Come on. Woohoo! Definitely break for ice cream. Uh, water break, water break. And you know what? What else? Grab those dumbbells. Because the next round, number four, is again with those two bad guys. So get ready. Drink some water, stay hydrated. Because I got some more for you. Look what's happening in round four. It's going to be wide sprint and then we're going to have a mix of three amazing aqua kicks. 30 seconds each, four reps. Let's do it! Aqua sprint is happening right now. Action! Go, 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 go! Keep on going. Keep pushing those dumbbells down. Notice, palms are facing back. Ups are working super, super hard so we can maintain that tempo. Oh boy, when I breathe, when do I inhale, when do I exhale? Just breathe, come on. Push, 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 push. Blinking hard is here to save you. Oh boy, moving on. You're gonna kick forward, then a little bit to the out, to the side, and then sideways. Yay, switch leg, forward, kind of diagonal, and boom to the side so about 45 degree kick is your second kick forward 45 90 and you alternate leg which makes my job a little easier and i can just let you just do your stuff right doesn't matter which leg you alternate you know guys i was thinking we spend a lot of time together and Maybe, other than doing aqua class, I can teach you some Polish. How's that? Meanwhile, I'll try today, sneak out a couple of Polish words. Blinking heart means Beyonce serce. <laughs> Here you are. All right, moving back to wide sprint. Keep going, keep going. Push as hard as you can. Szybko, szybko. That means fast. <laughs> Szybko. Hey, you guys gonna speak Polish by the time we finish this workout. <laughs> Definitely, you're gonna put this one to your favorites and you're gonna repeat this often. Yeah, why not? All right, kicks are happening again. Forward, 45, 90, switch. This one is a little bit lighter and bouncy and happy and we keep on going like nothing happened good stuff a really good one you like those kicks this is something new just invented in 2021 i told you 2021 will be a little bit better <laughs> give those arms a little break come on don't move your arms. They need a tiny bit of break. Mm -hmm. Beating hard is on a screen again. What that means is that you are getting ready for your white sprint. Let's do it. Come on. Have no regrets. No regrets, guys. We are only heading closer and closer to 30-minute mark. Do you know what that means? We're not even halfway through which is amazing we got a lot of time together come on push 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 are you still smiling come on guys i'm smiling i really am 
are you? Come on, push a little bit harder. Beating heart. Ooh, couple more seconds, couple more reps, and you are kicking again. Push out, side, switch, front, out, side. Love it. Our legs just love those kicks. Can you feel this hydro massage happening for you? It's free. It's free. Free massage in the water. By the way, I recently had the best massage in my life. Ooh. You know, guys, massage therapist is one of the jobs that will never be replaced. No robots can replace massage. Beating heart is on the screen. You are excited because you know in a couple moments you are going to do it again. Yes, you're going to have that white screen happening and it's going to be as amazing as it was the first time. Three, two, one, go! Let's do it! Cha 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 cha! Super fast legs! All right, you guys, you have final chance to do this exercise right. I hope you're doing it. Be unstoppable. Be fast. Let's really burn a lot of calories. I'm really, really looking forward to hear from you how many you burned. Blinking Heart is telling us that we only have final repetition left mix of kicks for beautiful legs how's that oh my six pack arms beautiful legs we guys are leaving this pool like no one else today <laughs> just do your best Yeah, give those arms a break. Don't feel bad about it. I promise they're still going to have a lot to do later. <laughs> right now, all three kicks. Each one as high and close to water level as possible. Blinking heart. Telling you, you are wrapping this up. And you are ready for round five. It's going to be rocking horse and then aqua sprint. What? Again? Yes, but it's going to be a little bit different. For Rocky Horse, again, link those fingers or spread them out if you're wearing gloves. Yeah! Rocky Horse, lean forward, heel back, high knee. Heel back, high knee. Can we see it? There are two different moves. One works your hamstrings, the other one, your abs again, and of course, your leg. Here we go. And those arms are really dynamic. Not only you wanna splash the water, you wanna see the flow going behind and then you kind of gonna crisscross your palms. If you wanna move around, turn around, go for it. Your heart is beating fast. Did you do it? Aqua sprint. You're now moving your arms forward and back and you flip your palms. They face forward on your way in, back on your way out. Look at that. Do you guys see the energy on the surface of the water? You can see it? Come on. You have to see it. Come on. Push and push and push. Yeah, this one is pretty challenging for chest and back muscles. Why not? This is how we do it. Your heart is beating like crazy. This is happening again. Rocking horse. Yes. On the other side. It's even better on this side if you ask me. Have fun with it. Jump a little bit. Yeah, this one is a little bouncy. 
Oh boy, it reminds me I forgot my shoes again. It's Aqua Sprint. I'm doing my best. How about you? Can you say that? Come on. Make sure you're honest with yourself. If you are holding back, answer yourself question. Why? Why? Come on. Curl those knees. Use your core strength. Move those arms along. Back and forward. You guys know when you do your best, right? It takes a couple seconds and you are gasping for air. It's an hour class. I know it's not possible to do absolutely best all the time. Only when I'm reminding you. Okay, here's the beating heart. Here's your rocking horse. Back to the first side. You're gonna repeat those exercise. One more time, rocking horse. Then it's gonna be sprint. And then it's gonna be rocking horse again. Good, good stuff. This is the most intensive workout I've done this year. How about you? Let me know in the comments. Because there are many, many parts of those high intensity workouts on my channel. So if you guys like stuff like this, make sure you check the playlist. Let's do it again. Aqua Spring. This is final minute of this round. This is round five. It's going fast. We're doing great. Let's finish in style. Woo! Don't look around. Nope. Talking to you. Yes. Come on. Here is your beating heart. You see it on a screen, you feel it in your chest. And rocking horse, wrapping up this round. We are winning, guys. 10 rounds is no joke. I don't think we had workout with 10 rounds. I remember eight. Mmm. Doesn't mean I'm not checking my videos often. <laughs> Let me know, remind me, but I think the most we had was nine. Mmm. So this may also be the longest aqua workout ever posted on this channel. And you guys are doing it. You're doing it right. I always enjoy those final moments. That's how we close the round. Blinking hard. We are tired. Let's drink some water. Let's grab aqua dumbbells and move on. Moving on. What's next? Are you guys curious? Round six is next. Frog jumps. 30 seconds, we're gonna push those dumbbells down and up, down and up, and then I'll show you what's next. You can expect another great exercise just mixed in together. Yeah, on your exhale, move those feet up, lift up those knees as close to the surface as possible. Make sure your body does symmetrical moves, okay? Don't lean sideways, don't lean forward. Beating heart is telling you, you did it, right? You're gonna now switch exercise and it's gonna be side kick with cross. Now feel free to jump over a little bit here. Drag the dumbbell to the opposite side of your body. 
So you punch one side, you cross to the other side and you kick away from your punch. Now I'm gonna go with just one arm at a time. That allows me to move a little bit faster. I have quite big dumbbells. If you guys have those smaller ones, then you can push both arms away. But for me, it would be too much. So I'm taking a step back here. Frog jumps happening again. Here we go. Frog jaba in Polish. <laughs> jaba jaba. Jabi skoki, frog jumps. <laughs> On our exhale. Right, notice there's no jump up, okay? Your shoulders stay above the water, but that's it. You're not bouncing up. Again, you're doing more dealing with the resistance than with gravity in this case. Symmetrical moves as much as possible. Here's your cross. Happening again. Ta dam. Ta dam. I am doing amazing. Can you guys say that out loud? Yes. Come on. I hope you are doing amazing and I hope you're feeling it. We're definitely moving closer to those final rounds. We passed the middle. But you only gotta leave enough energy to like the video at the end or maybe you already did thank you if you did i hope you'll do it kicks and frog jumps again here we go on our exhale really lifting those knees higher and higher yes it's all about speed but range of motion is quite important too and your breathing because you're working your core you release tension from those hips do you feel it that's really happening with frog jumps it's great for digestive system too don't tell me to explain you know what i mean it's important too and cross happening again how amazing cross and kick cross and kick do it like there's no tomorrow because i'm telling you you guys are excused from a workout uh, not full workout but pick something easier okay yeah that's what i mean Flex your foot, push that heel to your target and kick it. Imagine there's a punch back underwater. You guys would really have to kick hard to push that punch back away, even a tiny bit. Yay, yay, yay. And frog jumps happening again. This is amazing tempo of yours. You're not holding back. You're not wasting your time, right? No, I'm not. <laughs> you're not, I know you're not. Keep going. Oh boy, it's cross. Let's go, let's go. Cross is a lot of fun. It definitely releases that tension from our body, right? Right. Anytime we jump over, it feels a little lighter, a little more breezy. It feels like summer. It feels like we're burning calories. It's cool. And here's blinking heart popping up on a screen, reminding you it's almost over. And time for frog jumps. All right.
Feel free to turn around or move around as long as you can maintain best tempo of yours. Focus on your breath and fully exhale and feel how this belly button goes in toward your spine. Side kick and cross. Come on, use your arm strength. You getting a beautiful bicep right here, right now. It's worth the extra effort. Yes, it is. Let's put aqua dumbbells away, I told you. We're gonna move on to round seven, aqua sprint, and we're gonna run forward and backwards for 30 seconds. One of my favorite moves for sure, one step forward, one step back. It's the same foot that takes you forward and back. And with your arms, you just wanna quickly make that happen and maintain great tempo. I'm turning around because I feel like dancing today. Keep going, you want to push your body through the wall of water. Wrapping up this first 30 second segments and break the door kicks. Now that's the name that definitely explain how much strength you put, you should push, put to each push. <laughs> On your exhale, kick both feet forward toward the invisible door. Well, let's say you found Atlantis and there's a big door that's going to lead you into that amazing lost city, but you really have to push hard first to open the door. Come on, push hard. Come on, we really want to see it. All right, sprint, switch leg. That takes you forward and back, front, front, back, back. Keep those arms moving quickly, allowing you to make that happen. There is a little bit of bounce up and down, but it's small. You got it under control. Front, front, back, back, front, front, back, back. Do you feel the energy? Come on, final seconds are actually the fastest. Break the door again. Push your feet forward on your exhale. And with that exhale, you guys should breathe out through your mouth. But if you close your lips and you make that weird, funny face, you're doing it wrong. I see it all the time. I can't see you today, but you guys can feel it if you're doing it. Nope, you gotta exhale out. You can even say something, that for sure means you exhaled. Breaking the door. Here's your heart blinking on a screen, reminding you it's time for sprints again. Front, front, back, back. We're doing it. And I know you may be thinking, I'm tired, I want to go home. Well, not, you're not going anywhere until we finish, okay? If you could do it for so long, you can finish it today, uh, for sure. And still, you need a couple minutes to cool down, guys. I'm just going to link cool down, and I trust you that you're going to do it. Here we go, break the door. Kick, kick, kick. Good stuff. From all those exercises, which one was your favorite one today? Uh, are you sure that's the one? Yeah, you got two? 
Ooh, let me know in the comments. You say all the right things when I'm I would love to know. Maybe, maybe it's gonna pop a little bit more often in future workouts. Here is your blinking heart. What are you gonna do? Sprint, front, front, back, back. You got this. Still moving fast. You still have a little bit of energy left, right? I know you do. I can tell. Yeah, this workout you need to guys say for those good days when you wake up and you just want to jump around. Then instead of jumping around the house, jump into the pool and do this exercise. Blinking heart. Love you. Break the door kicks. Don't try this at home. It's only for this aqua use. Mm -hmm. Exhale. You probably couldn't see, but I hold my breath once and I it was uncomfortable. I hope you're not doing it. Ooh. Exhale. Fuh. I don't know. I feel like martial arts personality when I do this kick. I really imagine things that I want to kick. Doors, of course. Here's Blinking Heart reminding me it was an awesome cardio. And I want to do round eight with you. Crisscross with dumbbells. And then something even more fantastic. Here's your crisscross. You're not only gonna crisscross your feet, but also your arms. So one dumbbell, we has to go deeper, the other one a little higher. And this is a killer move. It's really hard. Yeah, we are really gonna target those chest muscles and back. And this is how we do it. Oh boy. Here's the blinking heart. Good, good, good. Floating scissors. Keep your arms open. Try line them up. You're gonna kick as hard as you can. Eight times, maybe four. I don't know. You decide. And then without touching the ground, you wanna switch position. Now, if for any reason you feel like you wanna touch the ground, it's okay. Okay, so you're gonna just jump down and then switch side. That's how you modify. You're gonna switch back to crisscross. You're doing it again. I know those arms are exhausted by now. But do we care? We guys have 10 rounds to complete. You knew what you signed up for. I know you can do it. Come on. If necessary, you can put dumbbells away and just finish with water resistance instead. But that's all I can offer. Oh, and how are you gonna do scissors? I don't know. And now I'm doing just four. Interesting. So I can do four or eight. Yay. Or five. Yeah, you can come up with your custom schedule for this exercise. Make it yours. It would be nice though if you do the same number on each side. I'll tell you guys, today is a little sad day because where I live I already saw flip-flops on sale and coats popping up and this means summer is almost over so I'm gonna crisscross now I'm not gonna think about it 
I don't know. I need to come up with a plan to be outdoors more often this winter and make more videos for you. I'll come up with something, I promise. Here's my blinking heart reminding us it's time for sideways scissors. Ooh, I feel my core getting in shape on one side, then on the other one. Yeah, right side must match left side. Mm-hmm. Because, uh, I don't know, but ladies, if you're buying that dress, you never know where that cute thing can be, right? Sometimes it's on the right, like a little hole decoration it can be on the back it can be on the side or well, let's work both sides <laughs> crisscross we don't only have ladies doing those workouts we have a lot of guys too and guys aqua is great for you as well i love having you on board in my aqua classes, we do have ladies and gentlemen, and everyone is doing amazing. Crisscrossing those legs on the side, scissors, cutting through the water resistance, switching side. Ooh. More, 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 of course, more. Keep those arms strong. That's your frame, right? It's a static challenge for upper body, but it's important that we can maintain it so those scissors can look better and be better. Every single muscle engaged. Sure. Oh, sadly, we're gonna put dumbbells away, but don't worry, here's round nine, skip B. Heels gonna move back, and then we're gonna do floating bike, which you're gonna love. Heel back, very, very powerful moves. That's gonna shape the back of your legs. Plus, we're gonna move forward splashing water out and then as you're heading backwards you're gonna push that water forward this is it i like motion i don't like to be on the same spot for too long how about you guys if only i got opportunity i'll travel even if it's just in a pool <laughs> here's blinking hard oh no no, 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 I'm not done here yet. Don't worry, here's your floating bike. Now tell, let me tell you something about the floating bike. I want you not to use dumbbells if possible. Look at those crazy fast wrist moves. There are muscles there to be challenged. If you can do it without noodle and without dumbbells, good for you. If you have to, use them it's fine it's all about modifying after all right here's skip b you know what to do splash it out splash splash then you're gonna splash forward heading backwards then you're gonna do it again so you're not on one spot for even a second you just keep moving back and forward back and forward like you own this pool maybe you do i don't but I make every impression that I do. <laughs> How's that for a good plan? Here is a blinking heart. Let's get back to our spot. Let's get ready for floating bike. Ooh, those feet finally have a little break. Abs on fire. Love it, love it, love it. Big circle motion. 
Do you feel amazing when you do those aqua exercise? I do feel amazing. I feel grateful. I feel blessed. When I was little, I thought I want to fly, but I prefer to be in the water. <laughs> I seriously do. I want nothing to do with air and flying. Even flying in a plane is not my favorite recently. So I'll take water. Keep on going, targeting those back muscles. Yay, those muscles between shoulder blades, they hard to target. Well, here you got your chance. Heels back, remember, mm-hmm, kicking your boom boom, right there. Do it, do it, do it, it's good for you. You can always modify and do one leg at a time if necessary. Blinking hard, time for bicycle. Float, float, float. If you guys don't know how to float, you're afraid of it, try aqua belt. All those aqua gears is so inexpensive and they are really taking those exercises to the next level. And sometimes they actually make them possible, like aqua belt for some. Yay, here's Skip B. I'm heading back away from you. And then I'm heading back again. And then I'm coming straight to you. Let's do it again. Heels back, heels back, heels back. Yay, those hamstrings want a good workout too. Why not? Why it's always about quads. Floating bike. Once again, proving yourself you can be weightless. Your joints, your spine can really appreciate this moment. And then we'll be appreciating it for the next couple hours. It's so good for us. I hope you're smiling. We are lucky to have this opportunity to do this workout today. So often. Here's the blinking heart. Do you know what this blinking heart means? <laughs> you do. Let's do it. Loading bike in a pool. Did you guys see this new workout where actually stationary bikes are placed in a pool? It's like a spin class in a water. Oh boy. I don't have access to bikes like this. If you do, let me know in the comments. I would love to know if you enjoy this workout. Never tried it. Maybe one day I will. That would be something. But after all, I don't know if I want to ride a bike. I prefer to float or use a real bike. I don't know. I, I, I'll think about it. <gasps> Round 10. Is that the last one? Oh, no. We guys gonna leave the best for least. Here's Aqua Sprint with suitcase pressed and knee tucks oh boy so you are sprinting look at me real quick one 
two, three, four, and then you tuck your knees. One, two, three. Oh my, what just happened? One, two, you're sprinting again. Knee tucks. One, two, how nice that is. Come on, let's do it together. One, two, three, and four, and knee tucks. Whoop, whoop. All right, awesome. Legs out and in, four times, roll over. We got it, one, two, three, and four, roll over. Mm, this is tricky, but at least we got those dumbbells to hold us in a position. Can you do it? This one is pretty advanced, let me tell you. If you guys can do it, you are rock star. You are rock stars even if you got to this point. That's amazing. Suitcase press, knee tops. Here we go. Come on. These are last minutes of this workout. Those last seconds really tells us if it's gonna be a good workout or great workout. I want a great one. Let's float. Legs out and in and roll over. Woohoo! One, two, three, four. Superstars, roll over. Do it again. One, two, three, four. Roll over. Guys, we are made to be active. Our bodies need to move. Being in place is not what we are made to do. In this hour, we've done so much. Aqua sprint, suitcase press, and knee tucks. So much going on. Ooh. Guys, after you complete this workout, please reward yourself with something healthy, delicious, okay? Make sure the 800 calories that we possibly burned will be replaced with some good nutrition. Don't waste your hard work and eat something crappy because it may be very tempting, right? We're probably gonna uh, want something sweet side but choose the good source of it fruits think vitamins it's gonna be absorbed by our body so quickly by fruits and veggies I don't mean fries mm-hmm Keep going. One, two, three, four. That would be a waste of our hard work. Do you know that the good workout causes micro damages to our muscle fibers? And these fibers need to be replaced, build up so we can be stronger. And that's why we need healthy foot after such an amazing workout oh you guys are doing so good rollovers Are you still with me? Are we doing the last final few seconds together? Come on. And can you still tell you're doing your best? Guys, I'm doing my best here in a water and after when I'm preparing those videos for you. Hoping you doing your job best you can. Find me on Facebook, Fitness Anytime and Anywhere by Majena. Also, if you want to support existence of this channel, check Patreon's website, see what's there and decide if you want to join and contribute as well. I appreciate you 
I thank you and I hope to see you soon. Amazing job, you guys. Bye-bye.